of all, congratulations on a stellar night tonight. Three perfect song choices, I think. Which one for you was your favorite? Dream On. It, I've been wanting to do that song since I got here, and when I told the producers that's what I wanted to do, they said, if you make it to the finale, especially my personal new music producer, John Shanks. It's his birthday. Happy birthday, John Shanks. Um, and he's just, he's a genius, so I can't wait to start making a record with him because if he can make Dream On sound like that, then. Because you literally look like a legit rock star out there with your no sleeves and all the tattoos showing, and you just did that song. Thank you. It's, it's not easy. <laughs> you also held your own against John Resnick of the Goo Goo Dolls. Why did you want to perform with him and do that song? Oh, man. Johnny Resnick is, is just one of my heroes. Um, ever since the song Name came out, and they blew up, and I, I was just, I, lo I love their sound, I love, I love their lyrics, I love, I just sit there and just put on the record and, you know, close my eyes and imagine I was him for a while, and to be able to be up on a stage with him was just insanely awesome, like, I still can't believe it happened, I gotta go back and watch it and make sure it was real. Put it on repeat, play it all yeah, the time. Yeah, absolutely. And so when you do make your record, is that the kind of sound you're gonna go for, or do you want to go for something totally different? Uh, it remains to be seen, I have a lot of different songs. Uh, and it's going to be like me collaborating, collaborating with some other people, and especially producers and such. So it's going to be a process, and I, and the sooner I can get to work on that process, the better. Uh, but I don't know what the actual end product is going to be yet. Who'd be that dream person you'd want to sit down and have a songwriting session with? John Shanks. He's awesome. I met him on this show, and they paired me up with him, and thank God they did because I love him, and he's he's amazing, and he's he's a legend. What was it like getting to see your hometown on the big screen there cheering for you? There's some crazy people in that audience. Yeah, yeah, well that's Detroit. Um, but that, that was really emotional for me because I know how much it means to them. You know, it, means, it probably means as much to them as it does to me. And to be able to give them any, any glimmer of hope and to help them understand that if you don't give up, you know, you can get through anything because, you know, a lot of people are having hard times. Not all of them, but, you know, you know it's, I have friends who have lose, lost their houses and things, you know, so... It's it's just it's just a blessing to get up there and be able to do that for them. Any last message you want to give to America? The finale's tomorrow. Yes, vote for me. Vote for me. Please vote for me. I need it. I'll take you all to Vegas if you vote for me. We're going to Vegas, guys. <laughs>